Good evening, Zas. Hey, uh, my name's Fred Mastuda here with Wyzant. Just wanted to help you out with this question here. So it looks like you had find an equation of the line in slope intercept form um, for a point that passes, or the, the line that passes through 2, 7 and is parallel to the line 5x plus 4. And the answer is to be given in slope intercept form. So what we need to start with look at the information that we're given. So we are given that y equals 5x plus 4. That's already in slope intercept form. y equals m, which is 5x plus b, the y intercept, which is 4. So I wrote off to the side here, m equals 5, that's our slope, and the point that we're given is 2, 7. So we need to use a equation called the point slope form. Now what we do with this is we, from, from this, the point slope form, we can use the slope that we're given and the point that we're given to find the equation of a line in slope intercept form. So point slope form is y equal, or sorry, y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1, where x1 and y1 are the positions on the point. In our case, x1 is, two, uh, x1 is equal to 2, and y1 is equal to 7. So we plug those numbers in, 2 and 7, and we end up with y minus 7 equals 5 times the quantity x minus 2. From here, we will distribute the 5 into the x and the minus 2, so multiplication, and that will give us y minus 7 equals 5x minus 10. Now, one last step before we get to the answer. We need to get this y by itself on the left-hand side. So we're going to want to add 7 to undo the minus 7. So we add 7 to both sides, and what we end up getting is y equals 5x minus 3, slope-intercept form. And to make sure that this is not the same line as we started with, it has the same slope. When they run parallel, that means they're never going to touch each other. So they have to have the same slope, but they do have different y-intercepts. That means they are different lines. I hope this helps you out, bud. Have a good day.